Um, for, for a quick bit of context, I'd like to say this is a portion of my interview with my granddad, who I call Opa, whose name is Neville, but he came to America and they changed it to Neil on his card. Anyway, this is a portion, because we talked for a whole hour. You know, we talked for a while. So, um, I was asking him how he, you know, came to America. And it was pretty interesting. But, to me, the most interesting part was when he talked about how he grew up during World War II. And I didn't actually know that he grew up during that time. Um, I, I don't know why I didn't know that. But I didn't, you know. So, that's, uh, that's what, that's what it's gonna be. And here we go. I mean, yeah, it's him talking about it. It's a story. Anyway, the end. But I also remember the war. Uh, we had air raid shelters in England. And when the sirens would sound, that let you know that the Nazis were on their way to bomb. So, were those still around when you were growing up there? Uh, yes. They bombed my town. Really? Yes. I saw the dog fights in the air with plane against plane and anti-aircraft guns shooting, trying to bring them down. And depending on the intermittent sound mm -hmm. from the sirens let you know how much time you had to get to a shelter. Huh. So did you ever have to go into a shelter? Oh yes, all the time. <laughs> really? Wow. But if it was a very uh, quick intermittent sounds, that means they're very close. Mm -hmm. You only have just short time to find safety. Yeah. Luckily, we had a neighbor that had a, a table made of steel. Hmm. And when they were coming in a hurry, they would let the neighbors in and get under that table with your gas mask. <laughs> yes. Was it a big table? Oh, yeah. Like uh, Longer than this. Wow. Yeah. Probably about a a four foot by twelve foot. Wow. And this is not even eight foot, so as a big, big metal table. But if yeah. a bomb hit close, and you know brings everything down, at least you're under the table and you're protected somewhat. Yeah, not from gases, but I had a gas mask. We all had a gas mask in case they tried to poison us with gas. Wow. Yeah. <coughs> so, all that all that ended by the time you worked in the coal mines, right? Pardon? All that was over by the time you worked in the coal mines? Yeah, I, that started, uh, well, the war started in the 30s. So, when they were bombing England, mm -hmm. I was about um, seven. Oh, wow. Uh, five, six, seven, something like that. So, I remember it well. Hmm. In fact, I had, when they were coming, you had to turn out your lights, because if they could see a light from up above, then they knew uh, there's people there and they could bomb us. Uh. So the lights had to be turned out, hmm. and you had to have a candle, and um, my mother, one night the sirens went and it was my my sister my brother and me at home my mother worked in an ammunition plant mm -hmm. a train ride away from where we lived so the sirens went this particular night so whatever lights you have they have to go out yeah. Light a candle, draw the curtains, which were black curtains, so there's no light can escape. Hmm. And then 
one that particular night I was reading a comic book and I leaned over the candle to read so I could see it more and my hair set on fire. I had blonde curly hair hmm. until the fire. <laughs> Luckily for me, my brother put it out, yeah. burned his hands, burned my head. Hmm. I still have a scar up there. You do? Get all across there. You have to look closely. Is it like whitish? Yes. Yeah, I can see it. Yeah, all my hair was gone. Wow. And then uh, we couldn't leave the house, go to the hospital. Oh. And when my mom came home, uh, the next morning, then they took me to the hospital. Hmm. The damage was done. <laughs> <laughs> and I had no more hair for a while. How long did it take to grow back? Oh, I can't really remember, but imagine, I would imagine a couple of months. Did it, did it grow back the same way or did it... Excuse did, me. Did it grow back the same way or was it different after? No, it came back curly, blonde and curly. Oh, okay. For a while, though, it was uh, straight hmm. until it grew more and then it got back to curly. Oh, yeah. What's your next question?